Closure can be a powerful tool for moving on from emotional pain or traumatic experiences. The idea that we can find resolution and closure after a difficult event can be comforting and reassuring. However, there are times when closure isn't an option. Whether it's the loss of a loved one, a broken relationship, or a traumatic event, there are situations where we can't find the closure we crave. It's easy to get stuck in a cycle of pain, anger, and confusion when we can't find resolution. But here are ways to find emotional resolution and move forward, even without closure. Before we explore how to find emotional resolution without closure, let's take a moment to define what we mean by these terms. Closure is the sense of finality or resolution after a difficult event. It's the feeling that we've come to terms with what has happened and can move forward. Emotional resolution, however, is the process of finding peace and healing within ourselves, even when closure is impossible. It's about accepting what has happened and finding a way to move forward without needing external closure. There are many reasons why closure might not be possible after a difficult event. Sometimes, the person or situation that caused the pain may no longer be present in our lives. For example, if we've lost a loved one or ended a relationship, we may not be able to have a conversation or receive an apology or explanation from that person. In other cases, closure may not be possible because the situation is ongoing or unresolved. For example, if we're dealing with an ongoing conflict or trauma, closure may not be possible until the problem is resolved. When we can't find closure after a difficult event, it can significantly impact our emotional well-being. Unresolved emotions can lead to feelings of anger, sadness, and anxiety. We may replay the event repeatedly, trying to make sense of what happened. This can lead to a sense of helplessness and frustration, making it difficult to move forward. Unresolved emotions can also have physical and mental health impacts, including increased stress levels, sleep disturbances, and even depression. If you're struggling to find closure after a difficult event, it's essential to recognize the signs that you may need emotional resolution. These signs may include Recurring thoughts or memories of the event Difficulty sleeping or concentrating Feelings of anger, sadness, or anxiety Avoidance of people or situations related to the event Increased use of alcohol or drugs physical symptoms such as headaches or digestive issues. If you're experiencing any of these symptoms, it may be time to focus on finding emotional resolution. Finding emotional resolution without closure can be challenging, but it's not impossible. Here are some strategies that can help. One of the first steps in finding an emotional resolution is to closely examine our thoughts and beliefs surrounding the event. We may challenge our negative or irrational thoughts more positively or realistically reframe them more positively. This may involve seeking out new information or perspectives on the situation or simply acknowledging that our thoughts and feelings are valid and understandable. Talking to friends and family members about our feelings and experiences can be a powerful tool for finding emotional resolution. Sharing our thoughts and emotions with others can help us feel heard and validated. It can also provide us with new insights and perspectives on the situation. Professional support can be an important tool for finding emotional resolution. Therapy and counseling can provide a safe and supportive environment for exploring our thoughts and feelings. A trained therapist can help us develop coping strategies and provide us with tools for managing difficult emotions. Practicing mindfulness and meditation can be an effective way to find emotional resolution. These practices can help us develop greater awareness of our thoughts and feelings and provide us with peace and calm. Mindfulness and meditation can also help us develop greater self-compassion and acceptance. Finding emotional resolution is an ongoing process, and it's important to be patient and kind to ourselves as we work through our emotions. It's important to focus on self-care and to prioritize our emotional well-being. This may involve developing a regular mindfulness or meditation practice, engaging in physical activity, or simply taking time for ourselves to do things we enjoy. 
Closure may not always be possible after a difficult event, but emotional resolution is always within our grasp. By focusing on self-reflection, seeking support from loved ones, and utilizing professional resources, we can find the peace and healing we need to move forward. Remember that finding emotional resolution is an ongoing process, and it's important to be kind and patient with ourselves as we work through our emotions. With time and effort, we can find the peace and closure we need to move forward with our lives.